Well, we're going to do a full trim on this cow today, folks. And she's got a little abscess, which you're going to see. Very fresh abscess. She's just gone lame the last couple of days, the farm said. And it's on the outer claw, the front, which is unusual, normally on the inner claw. But they need treatment all the same. We've got a bio block to put on this one. The reason we're putting a bio block on this farm is because the farm has got a digester and these break down quite quick and don't get stuck in his uh, pump or whatever it is. I don't understand myself. There's some sort of pump in the digester. I've never seen it myself. The blocks get stuck in it. Give that a second to dry, a little touch on the grinder there, as you do it with a knife. Now I'll get him with a knife and see what will come across. She's chipping away at it. See, it's a slightly different colour in the middle there and the day. Bear with it in tow. There we go. That's the pocket. on off there not to get too fine with a knife and I can have laid in the corium best I can. I've just got a little uh, cotton bud here, just push that through, that's where it popped out at the back, that's where I noticed first on it, that little bit at the back at the top there. chop all that out, it's not really do all it'll do, it's just a pocket for it to keep looking. left-handed knife and get a little bit more. That's going to be a bit cack-handed, that's why I have a left and a right knife, as I'm demonstrating here, to go in each way. And I think I've about, there we are, just removed all that pocket of the abscess. Just left with the fleshiness, which will harden over and turn into a new soul. I'll do that fairly quickly on this one, I think. Epiderma in there, epiderma spray, and then get a bandaged up with salicylic acid and derm paste. Turned round, weight bearing. I'll take that. I'll take that. How bad it was. 